do you ever put your makeup on and the lighting is bad and then you get in your car and you're going to film a vlog and you realize that your makeup looks like somebody punched you in the eye? Yeah. Okay, well, I guess it's going to be one of those mornings. Uh, I tell you, I've been having a lot of one of those mornings lately. You know, mainly because, sorry you guys, I'm backing down my driveway, and I am just, it, there's still a bunch of snow and ice on the ground, and I don't want to go over my grass. So I haven't done just sort of a chit-chatty vlog in a, in a little while, or it feels like I haven't anyway. How have you guys been doing? Let me know in the comments. I feel like I have not talked to my friends for a long time. I don't know. I And I have. Like, you know, I do three videos a week, and usually. Sometimes I do more, sometimes I usually don't do less. But... With the holidays and all of that going on, oh my goodness, I just feel like I've had so, so very much going on lately. I'm sure you guys have as well with the holidays and everything. So I don't know, even though I connect with you guys daily on my Facebook group, WW Living Life on Track, I just feel like I've been so crazy busy. Um, I just feel like we haven't connected lately. So a couple things I want to tell you if you don't know. Um, one, I always tell you about my Facebook group. So if you are not in it, please join because it gives me, I love when you guys comment here on YouTube, like I love that. So if that is your only opportunity, just know I read all of them. Even if I can't respond right away, just know I always read them and especially in the first one to two hours because I'm still sometimes doing some editing or I'm adding things like, you know, tags and whatnot that we have to do sort of like behind the scenes. So I'm always reading them and I do my very best to answer. But if you want a little bit more support and interaction, I am on Instagram, WW Living Life on Track, and obviously the Facebook group, WW Living Life on Track there too. But I'm also really excited to tell you that I started a food blog like I needed another thing to do. But I feel like it's something that you guys want um, because I am one of those throw in a little of this, throw in a little of that type of cooks. And that doesn't help you recreate a recipe. So into 2020, my big goal was to have myself set up to be able to provide you guys written recipes. So I started a food blog. It's called livinglifeontrack.com. I will link all this below, but definitely sign up. It is free. And then that way, when I do a recipe, I'm going to link it over there because then you'll have pictures and a little more description. Okay, let, let's talk about the elephant in the room. And I, I'm just going to say it. I feel like the elephant is me because I don't know about you guys, but I feel heavy and like weighed down, like my legs weigh more than they should. And I just feel, I guess it's when you eat off track, you know, not only do you put weight on and I personally myself right now am up five pounds. That's my limit, you guys. If I get above five pounds, it starts to get really, really hard to take off. You guys know what I'm talking about. So you have to close that window at five pounds, which today is the day for me. Yesterday was supposed to be the day that I was closing that window, but then my daughter shows up with pizza. And, you know, but I gotta, I have to be able to say no to myself. And I've been able to do that for two years. I've kept this weight off for two years. I didn't have trouble last Christmas. I don't know why. I'm having trouble this Christmas. Maybe it's because I'm a year older. Who knows? I don't 
No. Otherwise, fighting 10 pounds is no joke. I mean, that's digging out. You know, I don't want to dig out of a hole. I don't want to start the new year re-losing what I already lost. You guys know what I mean? So I'm talking to myself as much as I'm talking to you guys. We all need to do that. We really do. We need to, here's what we need to remember. I was thinking about this this morning. We need to say no to ourselves. That is totally okay to say no to yourself. We need to eat and walk away. I've been really bad with that lately. I've been just grazing at the table. So you know how that works. You you eat your meal and then let's say you've got a holiday party or you've got friends over or whatever and you continue to sit at that table. I will graze a bite of this, a bite of that. Well, we know that adds up. That's not, you know, that's not zero points. That is adding up. So don't do that. Eat and go find something else to do. Keep your hands busy. That's a biggie for me. You know, lately I've even been finding myself eating breakfast and then going, now I need a built bar. Come on. If you ate enough calories, you do not need to go get a built bar. It's better than going to get a cookie. But I think like for myself and if you guys are anything like me, eat your breakfast or whatever it is, eat your meal, and then just get up and make yourself busy doing something else. So right now, I am on my way to pick up my mother. Um, she has been put on no drive by her doctor. She's not really happy about that. And I have to take her to the doctor. So I have my meal planner with me. This is my the one I show you guys all the time. I'll link this. I use this with my um, meal planning pad. Life and Apples gave us a duo with a discount built in. It is not on their website because they did that for um, my viewers, which I'm so excited about. I thought that was so nice. So there was a, a meal planning pad that I love and then this meal planning book that I love, both of them. And I asked if they would link them together and give us a discount and they did. So you can get two. The two together with the discount is about 30 bucks. Um, shipping is free with my link, so I just want to tell you about that. I tell you guys that because there are a lot of planners out there, and I have fallen victim to them. I have one with donuts on the outside, and I thought it was so cute, And but it's really, really expensive. It was like $60, and I don't even like it as much as this one that's half. So anytime there's something that I think is a good deal, I, you know, I let you guys know about it. So anyway, I am on my way to pick up my mom. All right, I just pulled up to my mom's condo, so I'm going to run in and get her. But I'm talking to you guys because now I might not see you the rest of the day. Eat well. Don't do it. Know that I'm in this with you. We're all in this together. Do not eat the fudge or the cookie or the whatever unless you've planned it and you are totally okay with tracking the points and you've got it built in for your week because I don't want you to feel bad. I don't want you guys to be deprived, but I don't want you to feel bad like, you know, like I've been feeling this week.